I'm Mark Kuyper, and I'm going to demonstrate for you how we are boosting milk production in Africa using an alternative to liquid nitrogen for cryogenic storage. Artificial insemination is used around the world to make cows produce more milk. Artificial insemination straws have to be kept cryogenically cold. Typically, liquid nitrogen is used to keep those straws cold. It's a great system that works really well as long as you have liquid nitrogen. There's a shortage of liquid nitrogen in Africa. So we've come up with an alternative to the use of liquid nitrogen for cryogenic storage of artificial insemination straws. In this tank, we have liquid carbon dioxide. This is the same stuff that makes your soda pop and beer fizzy. Coke and Pepsi have figured out how to get this everywhere on the planet, including Africa. We've tapped into that supply chain with a uniquely designed handpiece and a vacuum insulated doer to make cryogenic dry ice on demand. The liquid from this tank flows through the tube to the handpiece and flashes into dry ice. Once the container is full, you have a block of dry ice. The artificial insemination straws are stored inside. This will keep the artificial insemination straws cold for four days. As cold straws leads to more milk and healthy children in Africa. 